think Chloe's played with her stuff, Shark. That was awesome. Who else but Chloe could turn cleaning her room into a pyrotechnical adventure? I think Chloe used to call this guy Mr. Sharky. I doubt she plays with it anymore. Why is getting rid of stuff so much harder than collecting it? Maybe because you're an overly sentimental hoarder? Granted. But I still need some more junk in the trash pile. You better not be thinking what I think you are. Chloe, I haven't seen you touch this guy in years. Why do you care? Why do I care if you throw my beloved childhood friend into the trash? I don't think that deserves an answer. <sighs> Sorry, chum. That's better. People say a lot of things about the Prescott family, but this is pretty cool. Mm. Hey, what's your dad's camera doing in here? Dad said I could bring it up here for you to use. He's tired of watching you drool all over yourself every time he uses it. His words. Your dad is the best. Sure. Just don't ever tell him that. We need to keep him on his toes. <laughs> You're off to a great start. Actually, it's kind of cool. Ever since I started taking photos, Chloe's hung them in her room. It's like my own private gallery. We bought this as a gag years ago. I honestly can't believe Chloe still has it. What about this half-eaten jawbreaker? A serious biohazard. You promised me we'd finish it together no matter how long it took. Don't be a quitter. You're right. Yes! The never-ending candy. Okay, whenever I'm ready, I can go tell Chloe I'm done arguing about trash with her. Oh, this was our first unsupervised concert together. It was so much fun. We were supposed to see another show next month, but... How sick was that show? The sickest. I've been working on my moves for the next one. Check it out. <laughs> How about you? Any new moves? Yeah, totally. I've been working on my air guitar. <laughs> Damn, Caulfield. Save something for when it counts. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back to the junk mines. That's it. I'm calling off the search. If you want more trash, you'll have to find it yourself. <sighs> well, it wasn't exactly the purge mom was hoping for, but at least we tried, right? Right. And now we've got the whole day ahead of us. What do two under-supervised friends with clean rooms and clean slates want to get into today? I guess now would be a good time to tell Chloe I'm leaving. Or I could let us enjoy the day first and 
Tell her later. Actually, Chloe, I really have to tell you something. It's... I... Don't know how Holy to... shit! Max, hold that thought. This must have fallen out when I was digging around in here. Do you have any idea what this is? Whatever it is, it looks like it came out of our pirate phase. Your powers of deduction are as strong as ever. This tape is from five years ago. It's a message from our past selves to our current selves. So we were eight years old? That's crazy. I can't even imagine what we sounded like. Ready to find out? Wash your hands, you grubby pirate kids. <laughs> so lame. <laughs> As I was saying, <laughs> if it's treasure you seek, you've come to the right place. But be forewarned. The journey will be treacherous and full <laughs> of treachers. Nice. To find the treasure of Price Isle, you will need the map from the manuscripts of Captain Bluebeard. Only the map can lead ye to the treasure ye seek, but be forewarned. Uh, again, only those <laughs> with pure hearts will be able to see what the amulet shows them. The amulet. <laughs> Good luck, and... Uh, bye. <laughs> Dude, that was... Hilarious. We were so, so ridiculous. We still are, Max. We still are. Okay, okay, forget everything. Today, we go treasure hunting. I think I know what eight-year-old you meant by the manuscripts of Captain Bluebeard. Sketchbook. This is where we kept all our pirate drawings. Yep. Now let's see this map. This looks like a page was ripped out. I wonder if it's the map. Hey, check this out. This page was ripped out. Do you think it's the map? If it is, there's no way I would have thrown it out. Maybe it's mixed in with the rest of the drawings? So much for telling Chloe now. <laughs> All she cares about is finding this map. But where could it be? Mm. Chloe's mom wanted us to go through this pile of old clothes and find stuff to Doni. Instead, we played dress up for an hour. People say a lot of things about the Prescott family, but this is pretty cool. Take that, Rat King. 
The Rat King was no match for us. Don't move. This angle is perfect. Why be shy? Get in here, dude. Subject and photographer. You really do it all, Max. <laughs> I try. Any luck? <sighs> nope. You? Nothing yet. Chloe and I were doing a lot of drawing in Miss Shelley's class. I wonder if the map is mixed in with her school supplies from that year. Chloe's so determined to find the map. I love how when she puts her mind to something, she just doesn't give up. Bingo. I'm remembering this now. Didn't we make some crazy puzzle? You need the telescope and the amulet. Which we hid inside a dark cavern, AKA the attic. Ugh. Why did we do that to ourselves? Because we were eight years old and the attic was the scariest place we could think of. You think it's still there? Should be. As long as the clean police haven't gotten to it first. Okay, and once we have the amulet and the telescope, we use them to reveal the treasure. Somehow. Here's what's happening. I'll head to the garage to dig up my old telescope. You go find that amulet. We'll meet out back at the pirate ship. You mean the swings? Yes, the pirate ship. Captain Bluebeard and Long Max Silver right again, bitches! I'll find a way to tell Chloe later. If this has to be my last day here, might as well have one final pirate adventure. Okay, Chloe said she hid the amulet in the attic. The only way in is through the broom closet. I slipped and broke this post a few years ago, but Chloe insisted on taking all the blame. Even after she got grounded, she never squealed. What a friend. take this view in again. Chloe's mom is trying to quit smoking. Hmm. The principal at Blackwell wants to meet with Chloe's parents. I wonder what about. get into a fight? She never gets in trouble. I'm glad her dad stood up for her. Voicemail? I wonder if it's still there. Sometimes I really wish I had siblings. Chloe hasn't mentioned a trip. Maybe it's supposed to be a surprise. Oh, 
so cool. Chloe is such a nature nerd. I bet she's gonna love it. Oh, Chloe's parents are so cute.